Welcome back to Trying Something New, where we try things so that, so that you don't have to. Don't draw on the table, please. I'm not. You are. Look at you. I'm just pressing the. Thing You're pressing out. the lead of the pencil onto the table that's See, drawing I'm on the doing pencil. Anything. Drawing on the pencil. <laughs> drawing on the table. See, if you press it, you it may have do this anything. back when you when we have a piece of paper in front of you. When you press it, it doesn't do anything. It only when you. Like, <laughs> But then you'll have an accident and draw a line on the table. I won't. Maybe this is a racist. Stop! Okay, back to our video. Uh, today's in a new, new box, and we have no idea what it is. Can I read any? Dent da da South Korea. We haven't had this before. We haven't had South Korea before? I don't, I don't remember so. What? I don't think so. <laughs> I dove for delicious Trevor, treasure in South that Korea. That looks scary. Doesn't it? She looks, she looks like an astronaut. It's supposed to be underwater scuba diver. Oh. That's why I want With a helmet an instead of a scuba gear. A mole? So what do we got? We got... Churro snack. We've got truffle potato chips. We've had those before. Oh, we've had those. I remember that. Cocoa corn girl. puffs. It's the same brand as something else we had because I remember seeing that girl. I think we have so, had that so good. Spicy chicken corn puffs. Mmm. Those are good. Cocoa pie. I think we've had those before. Cocoa pie. It looks like we have. Strawberry gummies. Strawberry, they feel like gummies, but. Strawberry, woman. Jelly dishes. What did you say? It's like a song. It was Strawberry, woman. I have no idea what the song is. I just know that one part. No! That's, um. No, there is a song that goes Strawberry, woman. No, no, it's not yes, Strawberry, it woman. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. <laughs> it's. More than a woman. Yeah. It's not Strawberry Woman. There's literally a song that goes Strawberry Woman. White Tort Cookie? Well, I don't even care if it's not the right words. I'm going to keep saying that. Grape Sweet and Sour Chewy? If that tastes like grape gum, I'm out. Grape, yeah. grape gum tastes like puke. <laughs> 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 we have to have this one first then. I don't know if you ever had grape gum. The <laughs> custard but cream But it cake. tastes like puke. I don't know how people like it. I can't like Oh, look. We've had these too. The chocolate crunch on a breadstick. We like these. Alright, what would you like to try? These, these look like Cocoa Puffs without milk. I just threw them. You don't have to throw <laughs> them in disgust. <laughs> No yum bag in this one. It's not disgust. I just don't. I'm too lazy to just put it down. The, I just throw the it. yum bags have the little hard candies in them. That was from the Turkish box that we just did. You put your whole hand in front of me. I did. Ah. Stop. <laughs> ah. Come on. Which which two would you like to do? Small ones since we just hadn't finished. Well, that. I I I like saw this and I wanted to do it. I don't even know what it is. It just looks good. And I obviously want to do these. Cinnamon something. Or but if we have to do two, I want this. That one and the and the grape. Okay. Because yeah. this is the, I'm doing grape first. This is really good. Why don't I try to smell it through the bag? I'm just not going to really smell it. <laughs> Does it smell like a bag? <laughs> what do bags smell like? Hot. It's hot. So spicy right on it. Awesome. All right, we're gonna do the sweet and sour chewy first. That's awesome. Explore South Korea. To Cor Cor <laughs> South Wait, show Korea. Like? No, short term. What you crazy. might know about South Korea. We don't like to read this. Hallyu, Korean wave, refers to the growing popularity of all things South Korean, like fashion, music, cuisine, and film. 
While the phenomenon started in the 1980s as South Korea exported K-dramas and K-pop across Asia, social media propelled it into a worldwide sensation that has made Korea a leader of the global economy. Fun fact, in 2019, beloved boy band BTS accounted for 4.65 billion of the GDP. GDP? Could somebody please comment and tell me what GDP is? Just look it up by yourself. You look at you look look up witchy woman or whatever it is, strawberry woman. What you might not know, in a headline straight out of a sci-fi movie, the first puppy was successfully cloned in 2005 at the Seoul National University. The first three letters of the dog's name, Snuppy, were borrowed from the university's initials. We would like three Snuppies, please. Ah, oh, if I could clone my German Shepherd, Keisha, and have her back, I would do that in a heartbeat. But why can't you? I don't know. Did they just say they cloned the dog? Why can't, why can't we all do that? I, I think you would have to do it while it's alive. Get her ashes. I, her ashes and then I don't know if you can get DNA strands out of a dog's no. ashes. Mm, take her ashes and then make it into a dog. So smart. Add water to it? Re rehydrate the ashes? And, it, and a <laughs> dog will grow. All right, let's try to... Hopefully, it's hopefully it doesn't taste like vomit. It looks like strawberry. It does look like strawberry. It's sour. Says sweet and sour. Ooh. I thought you wouldn't like it because it's sour. It's getting worse. Love grapes. Young Dong is your paradise. <laughs> Yeah, I'm telling you, that's what it says. Yog dong. Oh, he's hard to talk, talk with in your mouth. Oh, I'm not. It's so sour. Located in South Korea's <laughs> Chungcheong region, Yong dong. <laughs> what? It's where nearly 70% of the country's grapes are grown. Not to mention it's also home to Korea's famous grape festival. I still can't talk. Is it sour is making it's my mouth sour. water. It's not sour. It is. During this summer extravaganza, visitors make grape soap, dance in grape pools, and eat bingsu, shaved ice smothered with fresh grape juice. Fortunately, we can give you a taste of the fruity festivities with this chewy grape candy. If you close your eyes as you chew, the explosion of lip-puckering grape flavor just might transport you there. I, I, don't, I don't feel the need for another one, do you? No, it's not sour. It's not. It's not that good, either. That's good. How would you rate them? I would eat more than one at once. Like, I would eat one, like, tomorrow or something. You would eat two at once? No. How would you rate these, please? I don't know. A, a three? <sighs> two and a half for me. And you can read us a trivia question. We're already at nine minutes. Cause you took forever to read that. <laughs> it, I, it was funny. <laughs> you were laughing at the name, like it wasn't even that funny. It was very funny. The book glitched. <laughs> it got stuck. Um, I think it was a operator error. Um, which of the following is a common South Korea wedding gift? 
South Korean wedding gift. Um, live salmon, duck statues, bowl of rice or blue pens. <laughs> bowl of rice. What are the answers again? Live salmon, duck statues, bowl of rice, or blue pens. Duck statues. Want it right again. <laughs> ding, 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 ding. Did you mark this down? You did. All right. Ding, 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 Let me read about these spicy that. chicken corn pops. I hate when you do that. What? You go ding, 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 ding. I got it right. It's annoying. It's the, I hate when you get it's it right. The got it, it right it bell. Bad because you get it right like every time, and it just makes me like mad. Cheating, you're a cheater. Fried gang jong chicken, but in a snack. I think we've had this before. We may have. Americans bought fried chicken oh, to South so Korea in the fifties, but since then locals have perfected it. Korean style sweet fried chicken. Dak gang gong. Jong, jong is especially coated in a thin layer of batter and fried twice, resulting in a crispy, not too thick crust. You're eating them already? I haven't finished reading. And for the classic sweet and spicy sauce, we have Daejeon shop owner Young Jong Gi to thank. After customers complained of scraped pellets, he softened the chicken with finger licking sauce. Dig into the spicy, crunchy, Dak Jang Jong inspired snack, but be warned, once you taste Korean style fried chicken, you'll never want to go back. Are you gonna let me try some of that? Is it good? It's spicy and it's crunchy, but I wish I had more flavor. It's not flavorful? No. There's, there's no chicken flavor to it? There is, like, I wish there was more, oh, like, soft just flavor. Almost choked on it. Oh, I taste the sweet right away. And ever so subtle spiciness to it. A lot of chicken. You know what this tastes like? They taste like those popcorn, like those like caramel kind of popcorn. Like you know those popcorn you can get that have like yeah that are like coated. But it's it not. tastes like that, but a little bit spicy. But these and are just crunchy. puffs. Corn puffs. Why do they call it chicken? I don't taste any chicken at all. Is it supposed to taste like sweet and sour chicken? Corn flour, sugar, vegetable oils, tomato paste, apple, pineapple, onion powder, corn syrup, garlic powder, all the ingredients. I wanted to see if there was really chicken in there. And there is not. Obviously. They should at least use chicken juice, chicken broth. That's false advertising here. You're false advertising. What? Give you a smack. Being disrespectful to your parent. Well, regardless of the lack of chicken taste, these are pretty good. I could munch on these all day. But they're mild. I would like it spicier. So I'm only going to give it a four. Okay. And then what? Are we done? I'm still hungry. I don't know why. You could have some fruit. How did it was that? You're like, eat an apple. Like, I don't want an apple. Well, after all this junk food, you got to eat something healthy. Whenever you go, what should I eat? And then I go, an apple. You're like, well, I don't want an apple. That's the same with me. I don't want an apple. Like, You've never said that I should eat an apple. I've said it because you say it to me all the time. So I've said it to you before. You've never said that to me before. Yeah, I have. 
I don't remember you saying that. You're like, well, I don't want an apple. And that's what I always say. And then you go, well, then you're not hungry. If you were hungry enough, you would eat an apple. Yeah, that doesn't mean I'm not hungry. It doesn't mean I don't want an apple. It doesn't mean you're hungry enough. Nope. All right. That'll do it for today's, I can't say episode, because this is really our second episode of the day. We were so disappointed in our last episode in the turkey box that we decided to jump right into this box. And we did much better this time, didn't we? And we'll do even better next time. Leave us a like, leave us a comment, hit that notification bell. You do have anything more? Bye-bye.